What's up guys, this is iTweaks here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you a new tweak that just hit Cydia called Compose for iOS 7. Now what this is going to allow you to do is quickly compose basically any type of document that you want to. You can even do Snapchat like I have or TweetBot. There's a ton of different stuff and you can see that it just puts those two buttons right there in your control center. If you tap on those, it's going to automatically launch Twitter and then compose a new tweet automatically just like that again with snapchat if we go ahead and tap on that you can see it goes directly into snapchat and allows me to take a snapchat so we can go into the settings here and there's a ton of different stuff that you can set up so let's go into compose and you can see that you have left button and right button so if we tap on this here are all of the different options that you have here to compose so you have tumblr tweetbot instagram clear app calendar event facebook pose tweet fantastical i mean all kinds of stuff so if you're looking for something to compose then it's probably going to be an option right here so if we wanted to change this up we'll just change it up to a uh, new message right here and then if we went to the right button we wanted to change that up as well we can do a new tweet so we'll go automatically to twitter so it, you don't need a respring or anything like that you can see if we swipe back up you have your messages right here if we tap on that then it's going to automatically open up right there and if we tap on twitter then it's going to give you a little pop-up right here to compose a new tweet so really simple tweak and if it's something that you're looking for you can pick this up in Cydia for 99 cents so let me know what you guys think about this tweak in the comments below and if you enjoyed this video please hit that like button and if you want to see more of my videos and don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel all right guys until next time this is iTweaks with iPhoneHacks.com.